to uh, monitor and as well as to follow up on the locations that was given to SMK Petit uh, that was announced last year. In total, myself and uh, YB Violet Yong, uh, we have given a total of 95,000 uh, ringgit to this school for the upgrade of the football field. Mm -hmm. So today we are here to monitor as well as to follow up on the progress of the, of the project to make sure that every fund that is allocated is uh, fully utilised mm -hmm. and uh, the project is done properly. La. So today I'm here with the principal as well as the PIBG. They are here to see the progress of the work. Uh, we are informed that this is phase one of the project. Phase one of the project is uh, the levelling of the field where they purchase the uh, locations to purchase soil as well as to construct underground drainage under the football field. So that is phase one. Phase two will be the rest of the football field right. and uh, phase three will be the reparation and upgrades of the drainage that is uh, seen before here. And uh, phase four will be of course the retiring of the road here which uh, uh, will be in uh, for future collaborations and future projects so that uh, this, this, even this tar road can be used for the students for their athletics and uh, sports activities in this place. So, so uh, we are very grateful because uh, that the PIBG has uh, cooperated, uh, cooperated as well as worked together with us to not only discuss the plans and come up with a proposal but also to appoint a contractor that is uh, suitable as well as offer the best price for this project. So we are looking forward to work with them uh, in the future as well as all the different PIBGs in the different schools around Kuching uh, because uh, we all play a part in terms of providing a good conducive education uh, environment for our students and the public. So with this upgrade of the football field, um, uh, I was informed that the football field has never been upgraded nor repaired for the past many years. And uh, now that uh, with the allocations that was given through uh, the new government, uh, we can help address this need as well as uh, in cooperation with all the PIBGs of different schools. Uh, we are looking forward to work with them to address the needs in the different schools because uh, education is something that is important uh, to our hearts. So um, the policy that we want to practice is uh, there will not be any uh, boundaries uh, between the elected representative as well as the public, including the teachers, the principals, as well as the PIBG. So we are looking forward to, this is the first of our many uh, projects that we will be um, monitoring and also announcing for this year. This was, uh, uh, this was uh, allocations from last year. So the allocations for this year has not been released yet, uh, but we are looking forward to do more projects to increase and upgrade the uh, educational environment for the students in Bandar Kuching itself. So the, with the, after the fully full completion of the upgrades for this football field, uh, the football field can be used for many, not only just to benefit the students, but it can be used to benefit also the teachers and the parents where they could do family activities like a PIBG family day as well as uh, having the field being opened up to the public so that contributions from the public can go straight to the PIBG which can be directly used for the benefit and interest of the students and the school. So I welcome this collaboration with the PIBGs and uh, looking forward for more collaborations not just with them but more the other different PIBGs and uh, school board or school directors in uh, Banda Kuching so that we can provide the best uh, education environment uh, for our students and for our children.